In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you what you gotta do if your iPhone L drop is not working. Let's say other devices nearby won't show up on your iPhone or your iPhone won't show up on other devices. Let me show you what you gotta do to get a fix. The first solution that you have to try before changing any setting on your iPhone, you just have to turn off your iPhone. Turning off and on your iPhone can fix any wireless connection on your iPhone, including L drop. That's the first thing you need to try. Let's say you still got the same problem. Let me show you what else you can do. So open up the settings on your iPhone, scroll down, let's go ahead and click on Wi-Fi and turn off the Wi-Fi. Go back and turn off the Bluetooth connection. You're going to do the same thing on the other device. So if it is a computer, turn off the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth connection. If it is an iPhone, just turn off the Bluetooth and the Wi-Fi. Leave it off for at least five minutes on both devices. After five minutes, just turn it back on the Bluetooth and the Wi-Fi. And now just check if the L drop is working. I'm gonna assume that you still got the same problem. Let me show you what you gotta do. Open up the settings, scroll down until you see general, tap on that, tap on L drop, and just stay there. So grab your other iPhone or computer, open up the settings, scroll the way down until you see general, tap on that, then tap on L drop. And this is what you're gonna do now. So as you can see, we have three different settings right here. Receiving off, contacts only, and everyone for 10 minutes. So on both iPhones, you're gonna switch that setting to everyone for 10 minutes. After you do that, try to see if now the L drop is popping on your iPhone. Like for example, if I wanna send that video to this iPhone through L drop, you know, I click on share, L drop, you see that iPhone is not popping up right here. It's not showing up on this iPhone. So if I switch that setting to everyone for 10 minutes, you will see right now. As you can see, as soon as I select everyone for 10 minutes, that iPhone now is showing up on my iPhone, on this one. Just make sure you switch that setting to everyone for 10 minutes on both iPhones. And for some reason, you still got the same problem. Let me show you the last solution. It will fix any wireless connection on your iPhone, including the L drop. So what you're gonna do, open up the settings. So let me go back. Let me start over. All right, open up the settings, scroll the way down until you see general. Scroll the way down until you see transfer or reset iPhone. Click on that setting. Right here, let's go ahead and click on reset. You will see different actions right here. Reset all settings, reset network settings. That's the one you're gonna choose. Please make sure you select reset network settings, okay? The second one. So you will have to type in the screen password on your iPhone. Then you're gonna confirm to reset network settings, but don't do it yet. Let me explain to you what it's gonna do. When you reset your iPhone network settings, it will reset all the wireless connection, including Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, L-Drop, Signal, and other wireless connections. So now guys, as soon as you reset, all right, as soon as you press this setting, reset network settings, all the wireless connection will be factory reset, which means that if you had before, you know, Bluetooth devices, connected to your phone, you will have to reconnect all those Bluetooth devices. Even you have to reconnect your phone to the Wi-Fi network. Basically, all the wireless connection gonna start from zero. So you will have to reconnect your phone to Wi-Fi and any Bluetooth device that you have connected to your phone. But unfortunately, this is the final solution to any L-Drop issue. Just do and try to use the L-Drop on your iPhone. You will see that now it's gonna be working. Please let me know in the comment section if you enjoyed this video. Drop a like, subscribe to the channel. I will see you in my next video.